Good morning, everybody. Oh, my gosh. It's Purple Week. Yay! I love purple. And I'm wearing my special purple necklace just for this occasion. And I have to confess, guys, today, I'm doing this video live and I've never done this craft before. So it could either go brilliantly or it could go very, very wrong. So let's see how it is. But this week's craft is all based on purple and it has been inspired by one of our favorite top 10 books, Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? Do you know what there is in this book that's purple? Bunny Bunny does. He loves this book. Shall I show you what we're going to make? You'll never believe it. Let me show you. There's so many colours in this book. There's yellow ducks and white ducks and goldfish and black fish and black sheep. But look, what is this? There is the purple cat. And what noise is a cat make? We are going to make a purple cat and let me show you what we're going to use. I can't believe it. And I'm going to do my best to make this purple cat. Let's have a look. So we've got the book. Oh, funny bunny, you better be sitting watching me. So look, he's got the book. He sat on the book watching me make a purple cat out of a cardboard tube now i don't know if you've got cardboard tubes in your house but we have a local estate agent who's always given us big long tubes and i have cut this one out and it's very much like the inside of a toilet roll and you can use that obviously making sure it's nice and clean but we are going to make a purple cat out of this cardboard tube tube and this purple crepe paper so first thing we have to do is to cut the right size to wrap around the cardboard tube oh my gosh have i done it have I... oh look at that See, first mistake, first or oh, more or less. Thankfully, with crepe paper, you can stretch it a little bit. So there we are. We've done it there, and then we're going to cut it down like this. Oops! We've had this purple crepe paper for so long. If you haven't got purple paper, crepe paper, you might have some wrapping paper. Again, when I was growing up, my mum would say every wrapping paper that we had at christmas and we would iron it and reuse it i'm not suggesting you do that but you know wrapping paper don't just throw it in the bin you can recycle it because at daniel's den as you know we're into recycling so here we are look we're covering the tube with glue if as i said if you haven't got paper you might have a purple crayon or a purple felt tip and you can color the tube with that but here, look, I've put plenty of glue on there. And let me see if I can do this, if I can put the lid on. Oh, and look at the purple glue. It's got purple on there all the time with your children. There's colours all over. And to make a game of looking for colours, it's just such a fun thing to do. Here we are, look, we're wrapping the tube in purple to make a purple cat. And you're going, Joe, that is not a purple cat. That is just a purple tube. Well, let me show you how to make it into a cat. Squeeze down one side and squeeze down the other side. And look, there are the ears of the cat. Can you see it? There's the ears of the cat. So we'll get two eyes. And our purple cat is going to have bright eyes. Can you see the cat coming? Can you see the cat coming? There's his ears, look. And here is his eyes. And I've cut out a little nose for my little cat. Oh, that means I've got to take the lid off there again. And I'm going to put the nose here. Oh, and I've got some purple whiskers. Let me see, let's go. One. Oh, it's very fiddly, this. The glue sticking on my finger, but I think I'm doing quite well for my first one. Three. Can you see the cat's whiskers? Oh, my gosh. Oh, it's 
Oh, oh, got glue all over my fingers. Bunny Bunny's laughing. He's laughing. Can you see the cat face? Can you see it? And then we're going to, I just need to cut this other whisker in half here. Oh, let's prop that cat up there. You know, the one thing about crafts that I love is that there's no right or wrong way of doing it. Well, I suppose there is a wrong way of doing it. But if it doesn't turn out exactly as you planned, don't worry. It's all about having fun making it. And I'm really enjoying this because I think some people are thinking she'll never be able to make a purple cat out of a cardboard tube. But hopefully I'm proving you wrong. And wait till you see what I'm going to use to make the tail. It is incredible. Look, can you see the whiskers? One. Two, three, four, five, and six. Amazing. Look at the cat with its ears, its nose, its eyes, its whiskers. And I've got one last thing, but I don't know how I'm going to fix it on. But I have got a big black tail and I'm going to make it a little bit curly like that. And I may make a little hole in the back of the tube with some scissors this is definitely a mummy or daddy thing to do and i'm going to stick that through there and just do a little twist oh my gosh and look our purple cat has got a curly tail can you see it that is i think that was a bit tricky for you to see as i was making it and look there is our purple cat. Isn't that gorgeous? With a curly, whirly tail made from a pipe cleaner. Look, Funny Bunny's gone all curly, whirly watching it with the curly, whirly tail of the purple cat. He is amazed with it. Well, Purple Week, find something purple to wear. See if he can meow like a cat. You could also eat purple food. What is it that's purple? Purple grapes, purple broccoli, an aubergine, that's purple. Ooh, that's a very dairy fruit, isn't it? But yes, lots and lots of purple things. And if you have this book, see if you can find the purple cat in it. And if you haven't got this book, you know, if there's a birthday coming up or Eid or Diwali or Christmas, why don't you ask for this book? It is fantastic for learning your colours. So it's a meow goodbye from the cat. It's a bye from Funny Bunny and I. I will see you next time. Bye!